Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. And a long way out here. Oh, from miles out, he's done it. How about that for a pure strike? Terrific technique. Wondrous. Our camera lens trained on one man in wonderful form. Can he add to his goal scoring haul today on EA TV? Rain was in the forecast, and rain is what we have, sadly, here at the Estadio Benito Via Marin. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. And we're focusing on, technically speaking, one of the best leagues in the world. I'm talking, of course, about La Liga. It's Real Betis facing Barcelona. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. And the game begins. Mollejo. Barreiro. Robert. And it looks as though they might be in just for a second or two. Well, you can probably see why we're focusing on this fellow as one to watch. Stewart, in particular, what do you expect to see from him? Well, how can you stop him? 
If you get too tight, he'll use the space behind you, drop off, and he'll turn and run at you. Add that to his move. Oh, Stewart, they must score. Vigorous defending. Oh, blocked it. Sandoval. Leandro Barreiro. On the ball, Diata. And I must say, that was a very promising attack. The alarm bells were sounding. Teo Hernandez. Leandro Barreiro. And teammates around him. Splendid tackle and a throw in coming up. Couldn't find a teammate. Throw in here. Lacroix. Now Ben Davis. Anderson Taliska. And he saw the situation developing. Robert. Now the attack looks promising. Jean. Shielding the ball superbly. Under pressure here. Out of play and a Betis throw in forthcoming. And space to cross it. Well, the perfect tackle, really. And now a throw in. Robert. And an astute piece of defending. Paqueta. On to Jesus. Promising move from Barcelona. Fine cross into the middle. Still not clear. Real chance. Oh, terrific goal. How about that? Absolutely magnificent. And with that, the first half action comes to an end here at the Estadio Benito Via Marin. Into the second half then, and Barcelona hold the advantage, but a long way from being settled. Anderson Talisca, wonderfully weighted pass. able to close down the shots oh a very fine header but it wouldn't go in for him time for a change then well they're going for the short one firing is in flinging himself at it the keeper well, can they draw level here? The crowd certainly think so. He's driven in the corner. 
And a story that's been covered extensively on television and the newspapers and on social media. Angel Correa has completed his move to Lyon. Well, I think it's a good move for him. He has great ability, but needs to be that little bit more consistent. I'd say it's a fair price as well. Lacroix. And into the last 30 minutes now. The supporters want to see him have a go. Well, the hosts have had most of the ball in the last 15 minutes and have been really positive with it. They're creating opportunities and it's surely only a matter of time before they draw level here. Sané. Beautifully weighted ball. A glorious chance. Great reflex action. Well, that should have been a goal. Mind you, it's a brilliant save. An exciting La Liga match in prospect here on EA TV. It's Real Betis and they'll be facing Espanyol. Under pressure, doesn't seem to be bothering him. Will he play it in? Nicely saved. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Let's see about the delivery. Is it going to be? Tenacious tackling, excellent defending there. Well, nearing the end of the game here, and Barcelona are almost there, Stuart. Well, it's going to be a nervy end to this game, but if they do hold on, I think they've deserved their win. They've played really well, and they've played some good attacking football. And in general, they've controlled the game. Well, it comes down to the final five minutes. Couldn't hang on to it. And in with a real chance. Is it going to be? In it goes! the ball is moving again and that is that very satisfying from the Barca point of view a victory here what did you think of their overall display well Derek it was a comfortable win in the end fully deserved their victory because they dominated every aspect of the game it was a really good result for them here today
counting down to kick off here at the Metropolitano in Madrid. And this should be a game that carries considerable resonance. Atletico Madrid at home to Barcelona. We'll have every kick of the ball for you live right here on EA TV. It's always a great privilege to be here in the Spanish capital, Madrid, and especially so when Atletico take on Barcelona. My name is Derek Ray, and my co-commentator on this occasion is Stuart Robson. Stuart, what should we be looking at for today? Well, Derek, I'm always intrigued by this game. Two teams with totally different philosophies, so this should be a very good contest. And this is how Atletico will line up. Well, in this formation, the wide centre-backs need to be good all-round players, both in possession and defensively. They have to defend the box and also get out into the wide areas to cover the wing-backs. Well, this is what we think for Barcelona. Well, it'll be interesting to see how the wingers play today. Will they stay high and wide? Will they come in field and support the centre-forward? And how deep will they come out of possession? They're going to be key to this formation. And they kick off here. Good looking pass. And plenty of room in the wide area. And holding the ball up in a decent position. Lassina Traore It'll be a corner oh. And deciding to go short with this one Joao Felix And a body in the way And he's fired over the corner. No trouble at all as far as the keeper was concerned. Sané. You can't help feeling when you look at the table that when you're playing dominant football such as they have been, that they're going to lap the field. Well, there seems to be no stopping them at the moment. They've been by far and away the best team. Unless something drastic happens, I can't see how they let this slip. Oh, my goodness! What a strike from so far! Unstoppable! Action underway once more. Will there be a swift reply from Atletico following this setback? Mateus Cunha. Well timed tackle. Frankie de Jong. Robertson. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. 
Right, I think there's been a goal in the Valencia game. Alex Scott has all the details for us. It's a goal for Valencia. They're the first on the score sheet here with 23 minutes played. Thanks as always to Alex Scott. Nicely cut out. Gerda. On to Paqueta. As the stat shows, Barcelona have had less of the ball, but their attacking play has been really incisive. It's been a really good display from them so far. Nico Schlotterbeck. Traore. Oh, good vision. Almost found its target, but cutting it out in the end. Guerra. Well, getting close to half-time and Barcelona with the advantage. Stuart, what have you made of the performance? Yes, they've defended really well all over. The it has to be! Still a chance! But no, that's the end of the move because offside is the verdict. Did well to win the ball back. Barcelona now in potentially a dangerous position. De Jong. Magnificent challenge to win it back. Could be a chance to break here. Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. And so it is. The first half has come to an end here in the Spanish capital. Into the second half then, and Barcelona hold the advantage, but a long way from being settled. An incisive pass. Well, nothing comes of it in the end, because the flag has gone up, Stuart. Well, he knew where the space was, but he's just been too eager, and that's why he's offside. Andrew Robertson. Chance to do damage. And he takes on the shot. No degree of difficulty at all for the keeper. And a goal to tell you about in the Elche match. Who has scored it? Alex Scott can tell us. Yeah, it's a goal for Bilbao. The goalkeeper has spilled it back into the danger area and he is there to slot the ball into the back of the net nicely. They're pulled ahead by two with 53 minutes. Play. Oh, wait a minute, could be in here. Well, it looked as though it had a chance of going in. Well, he should make the keeper work there, but you sense a goal is coming. And here's a change now for Atletico. Paqueta. Well, Arsenal fans, no doubt about it, very excited given the transfer news. They've got the man, Stuart. Well, at around £45 million, pounds, I think... Oh, hang on, Stuart, look at this! And he did so well to move across and deal with the danger. They will now make use of their substitutes bench. And he's fired over the corner. Not away completely. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Terrific block. A very timely interception. Paqueta. Can he find the right pass? Oh, my goodness! What an outrageous hit! I can't believe he took it on from there, and neither can the goalkeeper.
2-0 now and back on the way well, there's nothing quite like the drama of cup action and you can enjoy it with us here on EA TV it's Atletico facing Hetafe well it's great to have a break from the league for the players and the fans everybody loves this competition and so do I it should be a good game it's there for him able to close down the shot time for a change then who can they pick out well, the keeper takes the fall but the main thing is he held on to it Well, he stopped them in their tracks. Breaking at pace. An attack full of promise. Felix could reduce the deficit. Really sound goalkeeping. Well, that had to be a goal, didn't it? What a stop that is. And time for the change now. And a corner for Atletico. And it's come off the keeper. Well, he stumped it out of there without much fuss. And Bernardo Silva has it. Can he find the angle? And there it is. All in the melting pot now. And what a finale we could have in store for us. Well, here it is again, and it's really poor defending. They just don't show enough urgency to get tight or make a block, which is why the ball's ended up in the back of their net. And that is that very satisfying from the Barca point of view. A victory here. What did you think of their overall display? Well, Derek, it was a really tight game, but they were the better side over the 90 minutes and they fully deserved their victory today.
Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and we're just moments away from kickoff time. Stay tuned for the live action. Well, Galicia is known to have the rainiest weather anywhere in Spain. And sadly, it has come to pass tonight here at the Estadio de Balaidos. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and sharing duties with me today, Stuart Robson. And we have live action from the Cup to bring you. It's Celta Vigo versus Barcelona. Yes, cheers, Derek. Well, what an occasion it is for this club and its supporters. These are the games that they dream of. No doubting they're the underdogs. If they can frustrate their opponents, stay in the game up until half-time, you just never know. Hopefully we get a great cup tie and maybe even a massive surprise. Celta Vigo. Well, with this lineup, they certainly won't dominate possession. If they can defend well, counter attack quickly, and get their front players combining, they'll pose a threat today. Well, this is what we think for Barcelona. Marc Andre Ter Stegen in goal. Thomas Lamar starts alongside Frankie de Jong in the centre of midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And so the match is underway. De Jong and a creative look about this oh it might be well somehow the goalkeeper got to it can someone get on the end of this Taking care of business defensively here. De Jong. Can they keep it out? Well, that's the end of that for now. Well, what a chance that was to take the lead. But you have to give the goalkeeper credit. What a brilliant save that was. And keeping the ball out of their own net can lift confidence throughout the side. And the keeper more than equal to it. Given away by Barcelona. Has the strength to hang on to it. But just like that, possession changes hands. Well, you can probably see why we're focusing on this fellow as one to watch. Stewart, in particular. What do you expect to see from him? Oh, look at Derek Charles here. That is a tackle and a half. Now, there's been so much talk about a potential transfer, but it's potential no more. It's fact. Well, it's an exciting transfer, isn't it? He'll add a lot of quality to his new club, and you'd expect him to have an impact straight away. Good player and fair value for him, I think. And nicely struck. Well, after that attempt, gobbled up by the keeper. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. And a long way out here. Oh, 
from miles out, he's done it. How about that for a pure strike? Terrific technique. Wondrous. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Alvarado. Alex Pozo. De La Torre. And he read it superbly. Well, as you see, Barcelona haven't had too much of the ball, but they've certainly shown an ability to counter-attack when they win it back. I expect more of the same. I think... Oh, wait a minute, Stuart. Look what's happening. Oh, he's found the net. And that increases the advantage to two. Just what they wanted and just what they deserve. Away again, and a 2 0 advantage here. Luca de la Torre. Griezmann. He's given us away. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. Referee's whistle then, bringing to an end the first half here at the Estadio Abanca Balaidos. Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. Perfect tackle. There's a slide rule pass. Great reflex action. Well, that should have been a goal. Mind you, it's a brilliant save. Playing it in, and he clears the danger. Sané. Oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. Well, threat over for now. Well, I have to say, I thought that looked to be going in. It was such a good effort. De La Torre. Griezmann. A more exciting La Liga oh, action. Oh, he's through on goal here, Derek. Well, I think you could call that an escape. It looked a certain goal. Guerra. Teo Hernandez now. And the counter attack is on. Options available. Can they take advantage of the situation? Oh, big opportunity. And there the attack ends for now. Alex Pozo. Loriolte. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Griezmann. De Jong. Sané. Now options are plenty. Well, that's one for them to pursue. He just needs to remain icy cool. Well, the keeper has outdone himself. Wonderful save.
Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Well, what a magnificent save that was. It really was top-class goalkeeping. Well, it was a splendid piece of goalkeeping, but he has to remain on his toes. Now we're inside the final 10 minutes in this one. And Celta have it back now. More action from La Liga coming up for you live here on EA TV. It's Barcelona versus Celta Vigo. Armand Lorienté. Not showing good defensive judgment. Thomas Lemar. Tremendous ball played through. Well, nothing comes of it. And there goes the final whistle. These are words you've doubtless heard on plenty of occasions in the past. Barcelona will be moving on. Yeah, it was a good overall display, especially up front, where their clever movement and combination play cause lots of problems. They'll certainly fancy their chances going into the next round.